Does this mean you found them? You found the archaeological plans? Have I ever failed you? Fantastic. I never doubted you. Now, let me see. Ah, yes. How clever. There's a chamber hidden under the Colossus itself. I bet my complete collection of Nagasado's Yavin 4 writings that you'll find what we're looking for in this chamber. I'll get inside if I have to destroy the whole Colossus. Such zeal. But destroying the Colossus won't be necessary. There should be a hidden entrance near the Colossus. It looks like Scotia has an entire underground base. You're looking for a tablet. The tablet is the symbol of leadership of an obscure Trandoshan cult. The lizards believe it was a gift from their deity, the Scorekeeper. Scotia stole the tablet and uses it to exert control over his Trandoshan bodyguards. Give them their relic, and Scotia's power over his bodyguards will turn to vapor. His own defenses will be his downfall. You could try it. It might weaken him a little. Scotia's not stupid enough to retain guards who could actually overpower him. The main thing is to keep Scotia's bodyguards off you. The plans suggest Scotia's apprentices guard this base. I don't doubt they hold the keys to acquiring the Trandoshan tablet. Best kill them all to be sure. Inupis jas nas jans, nao mipan asta na tods jans.
I've recovered the Trandoshan relic. Then we've both had success in our endeavors. But the Trandoshan bodyguards are only part of Scotia's defense. His greatest weakness is that he's mostly machine. The rogue Sith Lord, Grathan, is holding a cyborg expert named Dorotsek captive. He has developed a neutralizer for me, the kind that should destroy Scotia's cyborg elements. Find Dorotsek, get him to tell you where the neutralizer is, and then silence him. Do you have any other instructions for me? No, that's all for now. Grathan's estate is in the jungle. Interrogate the scientist. With any luck, Scotia will soon be out of our way, and then we'll be free to pursue Tulak Horde's lost power as we please. Ustaitnians and Parana, Rahitis ni Aino. Zash sent you. Please, I can't stand it here any longer. I don't want to die. I understand you've created a device that can harm cyborgs. Give it to me. The device? Oh, you mean the neutralizer, the cyber neutralizer. My finest work yet, though I don't quite see what the use of it is. Why, to fella Darth, my anxious friend. But that's just what I'm saying. I don't know how useful it actually is. Lord Zash commissioned this weapon against cyborgs. The thing is, most cyborgs are only 10% machine. You need someone at least 50% machine for the neutralizer to do any real damage. Tell me where it is, or I'll kill you. If you want it, take it. It's only a prototype, but I... I guess it'll work if there's one droid you really want to bash. It's in the lab building, can't be missed. But Grantham wouldn't let me have the power cells I need to power it. You'll need to steal those off his droids. Looks like it's your turn to die now. No, please. Lord Sash said she'd free me. Not a moment too soon, Apprentice. Tell me we were successful. Tell me you have the tech we need to destroy Scotia. I have the prototype. Fantastic. Magnificent. Perfect. Then the time to do the deed is now. Scotia is in his chambers as we speak. Be ready. Even with the power you have over him, he will be a frightful sight. 
Set your nerves of cortosis. Turn your fear into hatred. Remember, Scotia stands between us and glory. Let's get to the killing. Good. Now listen closely. This is how you will kill Scotia. The relic you found under the Colossus is the key to Scotia's power over his Trandoshan bodyguards. Go to Scotia's chambers and show them the relic. The Trandoshans should stand down, or attack him or something. The confusion should be enough. This is the first step. Then I use the anti-cyborg prototype to disable him, right? Exactly. With the bodyguards gone, you can get close enough to Scotia to use the prototype you stole from Graffens. But be mindful. Scotia may be more machine than man, but he's no weakling in the Force. Killing him will still be a challenge. It wouldn't be fun if it wasn't. Oh, I wish I could be there to see the contortions on Scotia's malformed face when you destroy him. Now, if you'll excuse me. I'm due to make an appearance at a party in the Nexus Room Cantina. Meet me there when you're done. I see. Nothing yet. What makes this slave so bold as to enter my chambers? Tell me, slave, are you insane or do you have a death wish? I've been asked to kill you, and I hate to disappoint. <laughs> Skisk. Kill her. No, I am not. I'm your master now. And school. I'm the dust. Dark Rivo takes his yazin. Not Wooja. But the Rukwa Chantessa. Clever. Zash must have stayed up many a night to think of that one. I suppose you'll be sending my bodyguards away now, or maybe you'll order them to kill me. It should at least be entertaining. Tear him to pieces. <laughs> You shouldn't have done that. The bodyguards, they're nothing. Show. But you subverted my authority, took my slaves from me, and that makes me angry. And killing you will be over too soon. No. I think you're going to have to suffer. First. Oh, my God. 
This. Ha! Ah, did you. Zash! Zash! You've killed me! Don't blame Zash. This is all me. Mindless. You don't know what Zash can do. Think. Think of how many years she must have spent. Plotting my death, she will kill you, just like she's killed me. If that day comes, I'll be ready for her. When I'd heard she'd taken up with a Mandalorian, I was scandalized. Just scandalized. A Mandalorian? Does nobody value Sith blood these days? I know. I know. Don't you think so, Zash? The place is Amin's White House fools. Go and did a seek from Tauhans. I'm sorry. Will you excuse me? I need to have a quick chat with my apprentice. If you must. Now, as I was saying. Thank the Emperor you've arrived. It doesn't matter how much one drinks. These parties are just dull, 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 dull. I hope you've come to cheer me up. I have dismantled the machine. He's dead then? Excellent. You have performed magnificently, Apprentice. None of this would have been possible without you. Lord Zash. Darth Anaton. I'm honored. You going to introduce me? Sorry, I'll just be a minute. Don't go anywhere. I have some further instructions for you. As I said, my lord, I'm honored. But why call me? You have nerve, Zash. Nerve. But I thought you were smarter. With all respect, Darth Thanaton, I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play ignorant with me, Zash. Scotia's dead, and you killed him. Scotia? Dead? That's the first I've heard of it. When did this happen? Just now, Zash, and you know it. What did you expect to gain? His position? His title? You know it doesn't work that way. Where's your discretion? Discretion? I've been at this party for ages. I may have had a little much to drink, but I'm fairly certain I haven't murdered anyone. Though I have always fancied Scotia's chambers. So much more shelf space. Zash, I don't want to have this conversation by Hollow. Report to my chambers immediately. Yes, Darth Anaton. It'll be my pleasure. Are we in trouble? Give me time to talk to Thanaton and then meet me in Darth Scotia's chambers. 
And don't worry, you've played your part, now it's time for me to play mine. We did it, Apprentice. There she is. It's Lord Zash's apprentice. Surely she knows. You wouldn't tell us if she did. Warpines break on Iswis, boy done. Still, it doesn't hurt to ask, does it? Colonel, let it rest. I will not let it rest. Everyone knows Lord Zash was at the party when Scotia was killed, and yet everyone knows she killed him. She somehow devised a way of being in two places at once. If I let it rest, we'll all be dead. That's not fear I smell, is it? No, of course not. But one must be ever vigilant on Drummond Cast so that your enemies don't gain an advantage. Maybe you shouldn't talk so much then. But I must know. Please, you must tell me. How did Zash kill Darth Scotia? Actually, I killed Scotia. Clearly, she's not going to tell you, Kiernan. Let it rest. Fine then, fine. But I'm warning you, Calaveras. Lord Zash is becoming too powerful too quickly. Since when has anyone in the history of the Sith committed a murder so brazenly, yet made it appear that she was somewhere else the entire time? It's enough to wake the Emperor, I tell you. Perfect timing, Apprentice. I just met with that insufferable Thanaton, and I have good news. Who is this Darth Thanaton? Darth Thanaton sits just below the Dark Council in authority. He commands me, he commands you. Scotia was his little pet, but the other council members were more impressed with our little sleight of hand. You would have been proud of me. I went into a reprimand, but I emerged a Darth. All you did was go to a party. I did more than you realize. Nevertheless, what's important is that we are finally free to act. Remember the map you found on Korriban that pointed us to the power of Tulak Horde? The first piece of that artifact, that power, is here on Drummond Kaas. This piece is in the deepest chamber of the Dark Temple. Scotia always hoarded the key to the chamber like a hut hoards his credits. Now I have Scotia's title, his chambers, his research, and his key. He always said I would enter the Dark Temple over his rusting corpse. However, I won't be the one to go into the Dark Temple. You will. I always have to do your dirty work. <laughs> Before I went to Korriban to choose an apprentice, a furious apparition awakened in the Dark Temple, implacable in its anger, murdering all who trespassed on the innermost chamber. But I had a dream. An apprentice of low origin humbled himself, or herself as it happened, before the apparition, pacifying it. That's why you and your peers were chosen. I always knew I was special. You've been a far more capable apprentice than I ever hoped. But for this task, you must put aside your pride. You must go into the temple and face the apparition. And when you do, I believe that your humility will be the key. Still, I want you to know, I'm not certain you're the one from my dream. I fear I may be sending you to your death. You're a Sith. Start acting like one. You're right. You retrieved the Holocron from Korriban when no one else could. If that's not proof of your destiny, I don't know what is. Tulak Horde's power awaits us both. We must not lose sight of this goal. Use this glyph to enter the innermost chamber of the Dark Temple. 
humble yourself before the apparition, and bring back the piece of the artifact. Sai galut saira, iswis us uf bandan ja atnam in puidangar ja. Maru jamun ja.